Welcome to another video about foods to heal stomach ulcers. Stomach ulcers, or gastric ulcers, are more than just a nuisance. These painful sores that form on the lining of the stomach can severely affect your quality of life, causing symptoms like burning stomach pain, bloating, and nausea. While medication is often the go-to treatment for stomach ulcers, the foods you eat can also play an essential role in your healing process. It's crucial to note that while some foods may aid in healing and provide relief from the discomfort associated with stomach ulcers, they are not a substitute for proper medical diagnosis and treatment. Always consult your healthcare provider for a tailored treatment plan that may include medication, lifestyle changes, and possibly even surgery in severe cases. In this video we'll explore the science behind how certain foods can help in the healing process of stomach ulcers. We'll also provide you with a comprehensive list of foods that you might consider incorporating into your diet for better gastrointestinal health. Whether you're looking to supplement your current medical treatment or searching for preventative measures, this video aims to be your guide. There will be also some answers to common questions at the end of this video so stay tuned. Before we proceed can we please request you to subscribe to our channel and also like and share the video. As this will help us to create quality content. The role of medical treatment. Stomach ulcers are often caused by factors such as bacterial infections, prolonged use of non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, or an imbalance in stomach acid. As a result, the cornerstone of medical treatment usually involves medications to kill bacteria, block or reduce stomach acid, and protect the stomach lining. Common medications include antibiotics to kill the bacteria Helicobacter pylori, proton pump inhibitors, PPIs, to reduce stomach acid, and antacids to neutralize it. In some severe cases, surgery may be recommended to treat complications like bleeding. The science of food and stomach ulcers. You might be wondering how food can play a role in healing something as serious as a stomach ulcer. The idea is not as far-fetched as it sounds. Certain foods contain natural compounds that have been shown to either soothe the digestive tract, inhibit harmful bacteria, or promote cellular healing, factors that can be beneficial in the treatment of stomach ulcers. For example, flavonoids, found in abundance in foods like berries, apples, and legumes, have been shown to inhibit the growth of Helicobacter pylori, the bacteria often responsible for stomach ulcers. Similarly, foods rich in antioxidants, such as fruits and vegetables, can neutralize harmful free radicals in the stomach lining, potentially facilitating the healing process. Another case in point is the natural sugars found in honey, which have both antimicrobial and wound healing properties. Research has indicated that honey can inhibit the growth of Helicobacter pylori and accelerate the healing of gastric lesions. It's important to note that while these foods can aid in alleviating symptoms or even promoting healing, they are most effective when used as part of a comprehensive treatment plan that may include medications. Scientific research in this area is ongoing, and while the results are promising, it's essential to approach this as a complementary strategy to your prescribed medical treatment. Foods to incorporate. Cabbage. Cabbage isn't just for coleslaw, it's a nutritional powerhouse rich in vitamins and minerals, including vitamin C. It stands out particularly for its glutamine content, an amino acid that has been shown to aid in the healing of the stomach lining. Incorporating cabbage into your diet is quite easy. You can make cabbage soup, include it in salads, or simply saute it as a side dish. Bananas. Bananas are more than just a convenient snack. They are an excellent source of potassium and fiber, nutrients beneficial for digestive health. Bananas may help coat the stomach lining, reducing irritation and excessive acid secretion. Enjoy bananas in smoothies, add them to your morning cereal, or bake them into wholesome banana bread. Honey. Known for its natural antioxidant properties, honey also packs a punch when it comes to antibacterial action. Studies have shown that honey can inhibit the growth of Helicobacter pylori, the bacteria commonly responsible for stomach ulcers. Incorporate honey into your daily routine by adding it to your tea, spreading it on toast, or using it as a natural sweetener for your dishes. Type of honey can make a difference when it comes to its antibacterial and healing properties. Manuka honey, for instance, is often cited for its enhanced antibacterial activity. This type of honey is produced by bees that pollinate the manuka bush, native to New Zealand and Australia. It contains a higher concentration of methylglyoxal, a compound responsible for its strong antibacterial effects. Another variety to consider is raw, unprocessed honey, as opposed to commercial, pasteurized versions. 
Raw honey is believed to have more intact enzymatic properties and could provide more health benefits, including the healing of stomach ulcers. Garlic. Garlic is more than just a kitchen staple, it's also a natural antibiotic. Research indicates that garlic can help combat Helicobacter pylori, making it an ally in the fight against stomach ulcers. Use garlic-infused olive oil for cooking, include minced garlic in your stews and sauces, or consider taking garlic supplements after consulting with your healthcare provider. Cayenne pepper. You might find it surprising, but cayenne pepper can be beneficial for stomach ulcers. It's rich in capsaicin, a compound with anti-inflammatory properties. Contrary to the belief that spicy foods aggravate ulcers, cayenne pepper can boost blood flow to the stomach lining and increase mucus secretions, aiding in the healing process. You can take cayenne pepper in supplement form, add a pinch to your meals, or even mix a small amount in warm water and drink it. Olive oil. Olive oil is not only delicious but also rich in healthy fats and antioxidants. It can protect the stomach lining and reduce inflammation, aiding in the healing of ulcers. Use olive oil in your salad dressings, as a cooking medium, or simply as a dipping sauce for crusty bread. Foods to avoid. Spicy foods. While some people with ulcers might tolerate spicy foods, they can exacerbate symptoms like burning and irritation for others. It's advisable to proceed with caution and note how your body reacts to foods like hot peppers and heavily spiced dishes. Citrus fruits. Fruits like oranges and grapefruits contain citric acid, which can irritate the stomach lining and exacerbate ulcer symptoms. Though they are a good source of vitamin C, those with sensitive stomachs may want to avoid citrus fruits. Caffeinated beverages. Coffee, tea, and some sodas contain caffeine, which stimulates acid production in the stomach. Increased acid levels can irritate existing ulcers and might impede the healing process. Consider switching to decaffeinated options or herbal teas that are gentler on the stomach. Alcohol. Alcohol can both irritate the stomach lining and increase stomach acid production, a double whammy for those dealing with ulcers. It's best to limit alcohol consumption or avoid it altogether when treating a stomach ulcer. Processed foods. Highly processed foods often contain additives, high amounts of salt, and trans fats, all of which can aggravate stomach ulcers. Focus on whole foods and cook from scratch whenever possible to maintain better control over what you're consuming. Dairy products. While it's a myth that milk can heal stomach ulcers, excessive consumption of full-fat dairy products can actually worsen them. They stimulate the stomach to produce more acid, which can irritate the ulcer. If you can't give up dairy, opt for low-fat or non-fat options. Precautions. Consult a healthcare provider. Before making any significant changes to your diet or incorporating specific foods as a remedy for stomach ulcers, it's imperative to consult a healthcare provider. Self-treatment may not only be ineffective but could also exacerbate your condition. Interaction with medication. Some foods and natural remedies may interact adversely with medications you may be taking for ulcers or other conditions. Make sure to consult your healthcare provider about any potential interactions and how to manage them. Balanced diet. While certain foods can aid in the healing process, remember that a balanced diet is essential for overall health. Relying solely on a handful of foods to treat an ulcer is not recommended. A variety of foods should be consumed to ensure you are getting a full range of nutrients. Food allergies and intolerances. Be aware of any food allergies or intolerances you may have. The last thing you want is to incorporate a food into your diet that could cause an allergic reaction or worsen digestive issues. Moderation is key. While some foods may aid in the healing process, excessive consumption could lead to other issues such as weight gain or nutrient imbalances. Always practice moderation. Observing symptoms. Pay attention to how your body responds to the introduction of new foods. If you notice worsening symptoms or develop new concerns, discontinue the food and consult your healthcare provider. FAQs. What causes stomach ulcers? Stomach ulcers are often caused by bacterial infections, long-term use of NSAIDs, or excess stomach acid. Can I cure stomach ulcers with food alone? While certain foods can aid in the healing process and full recovery, however, medical treatment may be necessary in some cases. Is spicy food bad for stomach ulcers? Spicy foods can exacerbate symptoms for some people but are not a direct cause of stomach ulcers. Is milk good for stomach ulcers? Contrary to popular belief, Milk does not heal stomach ulcers and may actually worsen symptoms by increasing stomach acid. How do flavonoids help in treating ulcers? 
Flavonoids, found in fruits like berries and apples, can inhibit the growth of Helicobacter pylori. Is Manica honey more effective than regular honey? Manica honey has higher antibacterial properties and may be more effective in inhibiting Helicobacter pylori. Can I drink alcohol if I have a stomach ulcer? It's best to avoid alcohol, as it can irritate the stomach lining and impede the healing process. Are all types of citrus fruits harmful? Citrus fruits can aggravate symptoms due to their acidity but are not a direct cause of stomach ulcers. Can I take cayenne pepper capsules instead of the spice? Yes, cayenne pepper capsules can be a convenient way to incorporate its healing benefits. Is it safe to consume garlic supplements? While garlic can help combat Helicobacter pylori, excessive consumption may lead to other health issues. Do ulcers lead to stomach cancer? Though rare, chronic stomach ulcers can increase the risk of stomach cancer. Early and effective treatment is crucial. Can stress cause stomach ulcers? Stress itself is not a direct cause but can exacerbate existing ulcers. Do stomach ulcers heal on their own? Some minor ulcers may heal on their own, but medical intervention is usually recommended. What are the signs of a healing ulcer? Decreasing pain and reduced symptoms are often signs of healing. However, medical confirmation is advised. Can I eat chocolate if I have a stomach ulcer? Chocolate can increase stomach acid and may worsen ulcer symptoms for some people. How long does it take for an ulcer to heal? The healing time can vary but generally ranges from a few weeks to a few months, depending on treatment and severity. Are stomach ulcers contagious? No, stomach ulcers themselves are not contagious. Although the Helicobacter pylori bacteria can be transmitted. Is coffee bad for stomach ulcers? Coffee can increase stomach acid and potentially worsen ulcer symptoms. Opt for decaffeinated versions if you can't give it up. Can I take antacids for quick relief? While antacids can offer temporary relief, they're not a long-term solution and should not replace medical treatment. Should I follow a specific diet plan for stomach ulcers? A balanced diet can aid in healing, but consult your healthcare provider for a tailored treatment plan. Conclusion. Managing stomach ulcers can be a challenging ordeal, fraught with discomfort and worry. However, the good news is that a proactive approach, involving medical treatment coupled with dietary changes, can offer significant relief. While medication plays a pivotal role in treating ulcers, the foods we consume can either be allies or foes in this journey to better digestive health. From nutrient-packed cabbages to the surprising benefits of cayenne pepper, there's a variety of foods that can assist in healing the stomach lining. Conversely, knowing what to avoid is just as crucial. Eliminating irritants like alcohol and spicy foods can go a long way in easing symptoms and promoting healing. Please subscribe to our channel. Also visit our website remedyu.com for similar articles.